These tags identify Esme and Brennan, two young adults who recently committed suicide. According to the American Foundation for Suicide Prevention, every year, suicide claims more lives than war, murder, and natural disaster combined. Suicide is an important mental health issue that demands conversation. The community walks are AFSP's way of talking. These walks are the biggest fundraisers of the foundation and the drive of the movement to end suicide. Every fall, hundreds of volunteers come out to end the stigma surrounding suicide. Over the weekend, Out of the Darkness held a walk right down the road in Santa Monica. The walk began at Wilshire in the 3rd Street Promenade, then wound its way up and back Ocean Avenue and ended back at the starting line. Volunteers walked for many purposes, to honor loved ones, to raise awareness, and to save lives. Parents shared testimonies about losing their children, and siblings expressed their experience through song. I caught up with the band Chris, who lost their brother Chris to suicide. The two sisters from Laguna Hills shared how they stay connected to their brother and celebrate his life through music. It's super special because we usually don't bring our brother's guitar with us to our shows, but he was a musician. He obviously didn't live long enough to make his dream come true, but it was so cool seeing like having his guitar right in front of us, and it was like so awesome. The girls share how they approach this topic with people their own age. You know everyone struggles sometimes, so it's like think of what you'd want to hear and then tell them about it, but just try and make it in a positive way. According to the Suicide Foundation, suicide is the second leading cause of death for teens and young adults. Out of the Darkness co-chair Amory Ankers admits that this is a tough conversation to have, but this younger group is more willing to talk. I see this younger generation as the key to, re to reducing the suicide rate. I really do. They're wonderful. Pepperdine Psi Upsilon Fraternity sponsored the event in memory of their brother Brennan Tatum. Tatum passed away just last year. Pepperdine SIU member Tyler Ryan shared what it means to be involved with this movement. By being participants and walking this, we're showing that, uh, showing those who are struggling that they're not alone and we're all here to support. The goal is to reduce the annual suicide rate by 20% in the next 10 years. The way to get there is to change the conversation about this mental health issue and to keep the conversation going. For Newswave 32, I'm Carly Hanna.